Gate Shea Myron Lies, your Navajo Nation Vice President here on the grounds of the judicial court system here on Navajo in Wind Rock, Arizona. And uh, the need to advocate and the need to recognize a, a day that taken place 60 years ago yeah, of our, of our uh, Navajo Nation Judicial Day here and uh, the day of the Supreme Court here. So in recognition of uh, such a, 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 a long time uh, of history of uh, advocating for our people, uh, the, the, the need for society to maintain a, a justice day and a justice system, I tell you, it helps uh, our quality of life for our Navajo people. And so here today to help acknowledge and help recognize, but also to be a part of the celebration that uh, your president, Jonathan Nez, and uh, Vice President Myron Leiser are part of. And so I'm just here to, to provide support and also the need to advocate for those uh, as you say uh, there's a principle out there that uh, um, is the need to show mercy, the need to do justly, and the need to walk humbly with our Creator is how very important it is. And so to recognize uh, the work of so many over here at the Wind Rock Judicial Court, which is also a representative of our great Navajo Nation, that 60 years ago, our people sought the need to advocate for one another, to provide justice, to set forth the mechanism of justice in our present day society. So if you uh, also to encourage you, I think our President Jonathan Nez also encouraged our society, our Navajo Nation people to uh, advocate for one another where we don't always have to call in the police department, right, to handle our matters of, uh, of uh, justice, our matters of uh, the need to uh, reach out across, uh, you know, uh, maybe divides and uh, to advocate the, for peacemaking at the lowest level, you know, uh, of, of, our, of our society here and at the highest level, which is our, our judicial system and our Supreme Court. So uh, right now, I just want to take this time, uh, you know, again, for 60 years, we've been uh, uh, talking about uh, keeping justice at the forefront for our nation, for our people, for our citizens, but also, you know, even uh, at the uh, government level, the need uh, to recognize those that are out here doing the work day by day, uh, advocating for uh, the, those that uh, maybe don't have a voice for themselves, and those that maybe aren't willing to take that that initiative to speak up for themselves. So the need to have a ju judicial system that would t uh, take apart, apply the laws, and to uh, rightly divide, rightly judge. You know the need for our people to just know that there is a system that's advocating for them, and uh, to be a part of this is a great thing. So 60 years ago today, our, our Justice Day and the the, the um, judicial uh, system was put in place as uh, our Supreme Court was enacted, and. Um, you know, even now, as we wait for uh, uh, justice to take place, you know, a lot of times uh, it could be a lot of negativity. It could be a lot of questions, a little a lot of doubt. But uh, the need to recognize and uh, to go forward with, uh, you know, even at the smallest level on a person-to-person -person basis, you know, the need to uh, reach out and uh, to talk about issues, to talk about taking up the plight of others. Uh, uh, there's a principle out there that says that when we take up the need or the burdens of others, that, that we can, uh, you know, walk in blessings of our Creator. And so even the need now days to, uh, you know, look at uh, opportunities that we could talk one-to-one. -one. Uh, I think in that talking or in that communication, we provide a mechanism of healing, uh, a principle of healing for our people at the highest levels and also at the lowest grassroots level. So today, we're going to celebrate, we're going to cut cake, we're going to sign a proclamation and uh, go forth uh, in our, the, his, the future of our great Navajo Nation. So I don't count this a small honor. It's a great honor to be here as your Vice President of our great Navajo Nation. So I'm looking forward to spending time with uh, all of our constituents here, all the people of our great Navajo Nation, and uh, look forward again to next year's uh, uh, celebration as we come forward together in one mind and one accord. Get along.